It's another morning. We're here, still here meditating. We've got the chance to develop good qualities in the mind. That's what makes each day worthwhile. There's a goodness that we develop in the mind. Because a lot of the other things we do in the world, as we all know, there's going to be floods, there's going to be fires, earthquakes. The sun's going to go nova some day. <clears throat> things outside have a way of changing around without asking your permission. So we make our lives depend on having a meaning based on what's what we're able to do outside, then it's setting a, we're setting ourselves up for a fall. <clears throat> but if you look at each day as an opportunity to develop good qualities of the mind, there's things like generosity, virtue, goodwill, determination, truthfulness, all of what the Buddha calls the perfections. Then regardless of how things turn out outside, we've still got those good qualities in, within us. And we're setting a good example for other people, too. So it's not just tending our gardens, we're also showing other people how to tend their gardens. So even though the specifics of what we want to accomplish out in the world may not get accomplished, but at the very least the good qualities that we develop have an influence. So as you're sitting here with your eyes closed, ask yourself, okay, what qualities of mind do I want to develop right now? Well, you want to work on mindfulness and concentration. You want to be alert. You want to be ardent in putting your heart into training your mind well. These are qualities we can work on right here, right now. And not only when you're here with your eyes closed, when you get up and walk around, there are lots of good qualities you can develop as you go through the day. Patience may be one of the ones you're called on to develop. Equanimity, renunciation. Sometimes they're not the qualities you want to develop that day, but when events force it, okay, it's good to have these qualities well stocked in your mind. And that way, regardless of how the day goes, you benefit from it. You've profited from it because you've invested your time, invested your energy in an area that really does give benefits, both in the short term and in the long term. So every challenge that comes up in the course of the day, look at it as an opportunity to develop good qualities in your mind, regardless of how the events outside work out. That way you can profit from anything. As John Fung used to say, a person with discernment can take anything at all and get some good use out of it. So even when things don't go the way you like to, you can get some good use out of that. That's a sign of wisdom and discernment. <clears throat> 